Hey guys, what's up? It's the Gas the Gang Guy, and right now, as you see, we are playing Binding of Isaac Anti Birth. Now, I will state right now that Binding of Isaac Anti Birth, or Anti Birth itself, is a fan made mod that I believe was two years in the making. Um, I might have talked about that last time I played, but either way, if you are knowing, if you, if you know about this fact already, you probably are part of the Isaac fan base or community or whatever. And you're probably wondering why I'm not playing after or yeah, Afterbirth Plus, and that's one, because I need the money for it, and two, I really want to play this. So let's hop right in. We're gonna be starting a new file. And uh, we're just gonna go for a good old Isaac run, not like we could do anything else anyway. So if you caught my last video, it was basically me saying that I was going to do a oh shit. Pokemon Prism Let's Play, and I do plan on doing it still, it's just that I was going through the game, and I realized that there are a, a lot of areas where the badges are, um, and I'm not sure if I'm able to, or not able to, but I'm not sure if I'm up to recording for a whole nother, like, big game like Glazed was. Which, I, I feel is understandable. At the same time, I need to apologize because it is kind of stupid. So, um, eventually I will be getting onto that, but for now, we're gonna take it easy. And I'm gonna do some Isaac videos, maybe. I don't know. I really like the Binding of Isaac, so I, I really, I really should have saved that bomb. Uh oh. Um, also... The audio is extremely loud, so I'm gonna turn that down. Well, that's just only turning it down for me, but either way. That way it doesn't affect the audio after I'm done recording. And bomb? Key, damn it. So, this is a really. I wanna say. properly built mod. Um, pretty much anyone who's played it so far, I've only heard good things about it. Which is great, but for the official mod that was released, Anti-Birth Plus, um, there hasn't been that many good things said. Though, so I'm guessing it's just because it wasn't... I, I don't want to like bite my own tongue or stuff in my own foot, but I feel like maybe it was because this added so much and, you know, Afterbirth Plus just didn't do quite as well. Uh, I think it was basically just an extension to an already existing DLC and whatever, I, f I find this game completely great with or without any of the mods or DLCs. Oh shit, got some friendly fry uh, friendly flies. And most of them are dead. So I've been playing the Binding of Isaac for a few years now. Um, one of the things I like to do with my friends is we would download it and do like these little races with each other to see who can get to the floor or the who could beat mom first or who could or who would go the longest without dying, in my case, because I sucked at it. But hopefully with this I can improve my gameplay, and... Um, if you don't know, Anti-Birth Plus... Or not Anti-Birth Plus... Afterbirth doesn't really start until after you Mega Satan. And I've never even... gotten to the floor that Mega Satan's on, never mind beating him. But hopefully that will change. And hopefully I can get good because I am a fucking scrub lord at this game. But I, don't want to say, I gotta stop saying but after every time I finish saying something. It's really annoying to not just me, but probably to a lot of people watching. Alright, it's so the first boss off is Gemini, pretty easy, just walk in a circle basically. Um since this is a new game, I'm not sure if like well, I'm, I'm pretty sure that this is gonna be. This is just completely like a fresh new thing. And now that I'm, now that we've like 
gotten pretty decent. I think that Taurus was a pretty good first item. Not to mention we just got re uh, regeneration with health up. So this is getting uh, starting out to be a pretty good run. We're only, we're only five minutes in. So, I need to, like, when I play games, uh, the magician that is homing tears, um, I found this, I started noticing that when I play games, uh, I start fumbling with my words and just automatically go to a story for like a kind of, like, cutaway, and I need to stop that, because I feel like I should be addressing the game at hand more, so what I'm, what I'm doing right now is kind of an example of it. But kind of not because uh, whatever. Oh shit, this room's gonna suck. And I might go silent here and there because this game, ah oh, fuck, does get challenging. To the point where you might need to just shut up for a second just to even get shit done. So let's. So, I'm hopefully not going to miss an item room on this run. We have three keys, so that means for the next three floors we should be good. I usually don't go to the, the charity room or whatever, but if we do get an extra key here on the way there, might as well. Also, I'm being really stupid with these fucking soul hearts. Uh, so those are free bombs, so I might as well go for the... And we got our soul heart back. Now let's go look for the item room. So, if you haven't seen my previous videos or whatever uh, of, of Isaac, or just, whatever, I'm not good at Isaac, like, I'm horrible actually. And I usually get these runs where, like this, it's starting off extremely well, but it's just, I'm bad and I'm not good at keeping runs like this up. Because you, as you've already seen, I've taken a lot of stupid damage already, losing about two soul hearts already. And I'm kind of glad- that's why I'm kind of glad that we got- Ooh. Um, is this good bad technology though? Um, good- I feel like it's bad. Oh. Oh boy. I don't know how this run's gonna go. Um. So basically I control my tier, my one big tier now with uh, the arrow keys, so let's see how the, all this goes. I mean it's going to be better for damaging people like Peep or other bosses that are in the game because they stay stationary. Well not Peep, but uh, there's some bosses that stay stationary. You know, actually, now that I'm thinking about it, this Taurus and this item do go well together. So, but this, I'm not gonna jinx this run, it could go bad, I'm not gonna lie about that. Uh, so let's... So, there might be a room down here. We do not have a shortage of bombs just yet, so I don't see no harm in looking for a, 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 a secret hidden room. I love how much I can speak. Like, it's beautiful. Yeah, there we go. Oh. Oh, well, this. So we just basically lost attack. <laughs> That's. That sucks. Um. I don't have enough money for that yet. But we could do this. And get nothing. Alright, so we just wasted, but. Two bombs this floor. Also, I just noticed I'm walking too all. If I if I seem off, um, so I have a fuck up sleep schedule, and if you've seen any recent videos, you know that already. Oh shit! Ah oh, fuck! This is not gonna draw. This is probably gonna be the floor. I have to look across the screen just to make sure that I don't that I'm actually hitting stuff at the same time. I'm taking stupid damage. So 
so if we can avoid taking damage for the rest of the fight... Oh shit, we almost lost it there. Um, I want to see if I can get a Devil Room. And we got it, alright. So... So the Zombie Baby or Contracts, is, these... Not gonna lie, these... These, these items kind of suck, in my opinion. Um, range up, tears down. Well, that's not really... Walk down, that's marvelous. Uh, we have... Now that we have, um... This tier, it doesn't... I don't think it matters now that we have the Magician card because I control the tier completely. Caves 1. Let's see. Does it? Oh, okay. It actually does something. It's like the tier slowly gravitates towards the enemies. So that's not bad. If I knew that, I would have kept it, but oh well. Just sucks. Like this tier is n fuck. Um, that's not good. So I need to find some temporary hearts now. Um, if you want to know what I just got, um, I believe uh, what's gonna happen. Actually, no. I think this is an item that's needed this mod. Basically, if I at least have half this heart, it's gonna keep regenerating itself. What is it? Something else in the room. Oh, there was. Yeah, alright, so... If I at least keep half of this heart, it'll always regenerate itself after the room is done, but if I lose it, it's gone. Alright, that was pretty easy. Oh, what the fuck is that? Blood bombs, what the blast plus HP up. Alright! I guess I could... This is a pretty good run, and I feel like I'm gonna blow it. <laughs> um... Like... Oh shit. Come on. Having a very slow... One singular slow tier for this kind of stuff is kind of sucks. Also, I now notice that once the... Tauros activates, I no longer have control over this one tier. So that's definitely gonna be a downfall. Also, I wonder. This takes half a heart, right? Oh, alright. So it's not gonna let me cheat the system by using the regenerating heart. Uh, let's use a key to get in here. So we have... I honestly don't know what the pincushion voodoo thing does. So I'm gonna go for this and I'm gonna donate the rest. Or not! <laughs> no. That seems about right for me. So, yeah, if you know me, I don't know when I started that conversation or if I even finished it, but if you know me, my sleep schedule is just garbage. So I think last night I went to bed at like I tried going to bed at like eleven, but I kind of woke up at two in the morning and it's been up since then. And right now it's going on noon. Uh, high noon almost. Ah fuck. Well, this this run has got us ups and downs so far. And I. Instead of feeling bad that I haven't uploaded anything in almost three weeks to my channel, um, I decided to start, uh, stop bitching and actually do something about it. Like, I, I do get upset when it's been a long time and like people do comment on videos being like, oh, I can't wait to see your next thing and I just don't upload anything for a long time. And I, I just feel bad about it, like, how could I not? I made a, I made a kind of a commitment to make videos and actually entertain people, but I've been 
putting it off for so long for no reason. So this is one of those bosses where just it's staying in place is kind of cool. Though he does move around. Though it's not that often. So, see? Like that. Oh, shit. So this is gonna be a very interesting run. Is this what I can all I can say really? If I get any tier effects, um oh my god, why these moves are extremely easy to predict, so I don't know why I'm taking so much stupid damage. Thank you for our health up. That's exactly what I needed. The damage up is much more appreciated. So hopefully a good chunk of heart, well a good chunk of, but in reality about a heart and a half drop on this floor, but every heart counts in this game. But, yeah, I'm fucking out of it. And so far, we're only on Caves 1. Surprised I made it this long into the video. Um, last time I did Isaac, I couldn't even actually like pay attention long enough to actually make a full video. I just I did commentary over the first few minutes and then just kind of let it do its own thing. Oh. At least we got keys. The game wants me to keep playing. How can I tell the game no? It's simple. No. Shit. Oh, at least we have a heart. <laughs> that that arcader is kind of a blowout. Well, now that we're in a room with fucking three pennies, I feel like I should have at least kept the slot machine. What's really weird about this mod is it feels real official. Like, I'm not an avid, or I don't know if that's the correct word, but I don't play Isaac all the time. In fact, I rarely get the itch to actually play this game. But when I do, it's, it's a good amount. Uh, like, I'll play it like, maybe a few times a year. But when I do, I just go on these insane runs that, like, just never seem like they would happen. Like, I remember I got one time where I got, like, a bunch of flies and I got the Tanuki suit on Mom. And it was literally just me sitting in the middle of the room of Mom's heart and just doing absolutely nothing. So, the tier comes definitely in handy for these kind of enemies. Alright, infestation. So we have some sort of, I guess, thing? I think it's after every room we get a new, like, spider or something, right? Or flies. Uh, I think it's actually a thing where it's you shoot from a, dis or a certain direction for a certain amount of time. Uh, I don't know why I came in here, I have no money. I think it's if you shoot in a direction a certain amount of time, it shoots a little larva out of your stomach. Which kind of sucks, because we don't really control our tears that much. It's also going to suck if you get, uh, start using Tauros right now. Um, can I tear? Nope. Oh god. Range down. We don't need that, so... Alright, so it's every time I take damage, I get a fly. Which isn't too bad. Since we are taking a lot of stupid damage, it's kind of a nice little insurance. And this is probably one of the best rooms I could have gotten Taurus to activate on. I don't know what- every time I say Taurus, I think of either Mega Man, Star Force, or fucking fairy tale 
which are both great shows, even though one was cancelled, but... Either way... Uh, oh shit. So, I need to find hearts before I go in there, so I don't think I'm going to last long, but also... Shit, we only have one bomb, so I only have one chance of finding the hidden room. Why is my hand cramping up? Holy shit, like this is... it hurts. Right, so it's definitely not one of these rooms. Um, for a hidden room to be accessible, it has to have a pathway to get to it on all sides. And as you can see, I completely wasted a bomb. Um, these three coins ain't worth it. Luckily we did get two half hearts in here earlier. But we also have two rooms we could possibly explore, which I feel like I should have saved those half hearts afterwards. So, I'm trying to control this tier as best as I can. At the same time, I'm not looking at Isaac when I'm doing so, and it sucks. Ah oh, shit, this room. This room is not gonna be kind to me. So we got another half heart. Which... Fuck! Well, never mind. we don't have another half heart. But we did get Taurus to activate. So maybe we'll get lucky and drop a troll bomb. Okay, never mind. So this floor was ultimately a bust. Um, unless well, we don't have any bombs, so we can't find any kind of help. I was thinking maybe going to the store and buying... Uh, I think there was a heart there for three coins, but then I realized we don't have bombs or cash, so... That's great. I'm gonna switch my hand for a second. Wow, that sucks. I need to find a better way to sit in doing this. And oh, great! I'm definitely not gonna be able to beat this boss. Or at least I. F ah, we're doing a decent amount of damage. Once Taurus activates, we should be good. Yeah. Okay. So once the speed boost hits a hunt or one percent up, that's when. Um, that's when Taurus activates, and it's nice to have this little um, sidebar here. Uh, this is built into Afterbirth, or Antibirth, and there's also this one that will show us every item we got so far. Also, if you want the seed, uh, it's right there. Oh no, 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 I almost went down a floor without taking anything. So speed up, which I guess is okay for dodging. So we're almost that bomb, and we're in the amount of time. Maybe we could do a boss rush? Actually, I don't want to do a boss rush now that I think about it. Because bosses like this do not seem very fun. If anything, I was hoping this would maybe be like the floor boss, but I agree. Right, we got a bomb. Um, so I, hope I don't think there's any item rooms on these floors, are there? Shit, I'm doing the thing where I look at fucking tier again, not Isaac. Which almost resulted in a lot of dumb damage. Oh. Oh. Okay, that was great. Oh my. Yo. Alright, so I didn't know that Blood Bomb actually took a half a heart to use. Like, it didn't- I didn't know it took half a heart to actually use the bomb. Like, if you didn't have any left. So this is... I... Oh my god. This run. If I lose this, I'm gonna be so upset. Oh yeah, we also have health regeneration because of the placenta. That's a really weird thing now that I say that out loud. I don't have to worry about wasting bombs on bosses and stuff. 
Because that was one of my main concerns, was I didn't want to use a bomb on a boss. Can you imagine if there was an item that gave you permanent, like, Tauros? Uh, so every few rooms we're gonna have... These, these kind of rooms are gonna suck for our remote control tier. So, maybe. So, there is, I think, maybe two hidden rooms each floor. But we've only been going over one because that's all we've had the. the bombs for. Also, having tiers like this make rooms like this extremely easy. Magician? Strength. Okay, damage up. That's not too bad. I think I might save that till the next floor, though. Yeah, we don't have the best damage, but it's definitely not bad this this round. Also, I need to fucking get my shit together, because I'm taking a lot of damage. We already have less than half max health. Okay, never mind. I don't like dingles. I don't. I don't like the poos. I don't know why, but they're just some of the worst enemies in my opinion to face. Because I'm, I'm, like, I'm just bad. Like, I, I don't know how many times I can say that before it gets old, but... I'm just bad at this game, so that makes certain enemy... That means that, especially with certain enemies, I am just trash. Okay, so please be health up or I mean, I would have preferred bomb seal, but damage reduction ain't bad. But we only have two and a half hearts, and I don't know how all this is gonna go. So I need to find maybe a room full of hearts or something. Or exactly that. Okay, this isn't scripted. This is, as you can see, because I've unlocked things, that this is a seed that I just generated. So I, this isn't something I did beforehand. Like, this is insane. Um, no, why not? And of course we have greed. I kinda wish I had Brimstone, not gonna lie. A lot of money and a bomb. Which we don't need, because we have almost the full stack. But it does suck that we didn't. Right, so. Fuck. So this is a new enemy. This is from. This, this is from Anti Birth, I know that. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. This is, this might be a dud run. I don't know these attack patterns good enough. Uh oh. Oh no. No, I don't want to. Don't want to die. No, flies attack. This could be the end of it.
shit. We're gonna make it to mom's floor, but I can't guarantee we'll actually live. So, I don't... Hmm... So, the hangman makes it so we have the ability to fly for one room, I think. But strength gives us damage up. Which, after that room, we we definitely need damage. I'm going to keep strength. I'm probably going to regret that because it's probably going to be some hearts or something I can't access on this floor because I did it. But I need... I need strength. Oh, shit. Shit. This floor might not go too well. So we have one heart left. This is not going to be great. Or to just go almost... Just four hands? Beautiful. So far, I think we've only had one bad item. And that was the uh, larva. Shit, see, I need. I knew I needed the hangman. Um, so, anything in these hearts? Or these fires? So if I can get an item in this room, like maybe explosion seal or something, I don't know. That would be great. Not fucking in that room. That was perfect. Aquarius, Trail of Tears, I believe. Right? Yeah. So now we have a damaging path behind us. Kind of tempt to unlock all of these because all of, well, I think this is the final floor, right? This because you can't unlock these, and sometimes they will break into parts. Oh, well, rip this run. What the fuck's going on? This battery back there is it? I mean, if I can find a shot. Oh no. So I really want to fight mom the first time we play, but at the same time, I don't want to die. Please be. We also have all this money too, and we can't spend it. took way too much stupid damage this game. Ooh, no, I almost walked right into the fire. So we know the room's not there and it's not here. So it's probably somewhere over here. Don't have a key anymore. Because I wasted them all in that one room. Trying to find a heart in a fucking box. Too dangerous. I think I hit myself with a bomb when I was invincible. Which I'm okay with since I didn't take any damage. Also, please be a heart. I don't I think this charges an item every time you use it. Oh, double key room, that could have been better something. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. 
Don't you have like dad's key or something that makes keys like um, you have a lucky key or something that makes keys drop more often? Man, now I could have now I definitely know three good uses for those keys that we had. If I can just find two keys, I'd be happy. Shit. No. So upset with myself. How did I get this run get this bad? Shot speed up speed down. I don't know if that was worth it or not. It does do damage every time uh, when that heart's gone, but at the same time, I don't know if I'm gonna last long enough to make it useful. See my, see, my only other choice at this point now is to just go to the go to mom. I don't know why that room isn't highlighted. I'm just thinking maybe there's like a secret room or something that's just filled with hearts because I know they exist. Also, we haven't discovered the boss door, so this this could just ruin everything. Full health, one party. Fuck. So we two hearting mom. Okay, let me get myself prepared for this. This would be a shit show. What? All I did was use strength. Shit. Oh, no, 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 You have one heart. You're not one hearted mom, I can guarantee that. Well, that was my run. Um, overall, we had great items. Tauros first, then Placenta, then that. I mean, I think what really screwed us off in the end was the the one tier. But, damn. The next time, we're definitely beating Mom, hopefully. 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 Oh, no, 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 don't. Don't restart, no. Alright, well... Next time, we're going to be doing another Isaac run. Um, so far, we're at a win streak of negative one, but that's definitely not going to get us down. So until next time, I hope you all have a great day, and I uh, hope you enjoy the video. Leave a like down below if you want to see more videos like this. Subscribe if you want to see other content from me and more content coming in the future. And um, yeah, during times like this, I usually forget my outro, which I, I know it's hard to believe, but I'm fucking tired. This is almost an hour long session of Isaac, and I'm surprised that it was even that long. Um, but yeah, until next time, I hope you have a great day, and. Uh, yeah, I said the subscribe and the comment thing, so. Uh, bye bye.